everyone, my name is Webweaver, and welcome back to another episode of World of Horror. Uh, alright, so what are we doing? We got four achievements left, realistically three, because I assume dude is unlocked when you, you know, complete the other achievements. So, we've got Hail to the King, we've got Can You Trust Them, and we've got Real Nightmare. Real Nightmare is kind of annoying. Same thing with uh, Can You Trust Them. Uh, Hail to the King is interesting because it's- the chainsaw being changed to perception is actually just, like, a Moriko buff. Like, just fully a Moriko buff. Because she's already gonna level perception. So, and you're already gonna have a flashlight because you don't need to, uh, potentially buy the HDF because you need a stopgap weapon until you get the chainsaw. No, you can just buy the flashlight, take plus one perception, it synergizes with the chainsaw, it works out really well. Um, I know a lot of people didn't like the uh, change from Strength to Perception, but I actually think that it's an interesting little bit of synergy, and it makes Perception a better stat, so I'm always happy about other stats becoming a little bit more viable. Of course, it is only one weapon. So I think what we're going to try to do, and this might be antithetical to actually winning the game, because I feel like we're going to doom out really hard, but we're going to go... Can you trust them, Hail to the King? That's gonna be A, and this is gonna be B. We're going H, sorry, it's gonna be H, my mistake. H moment. It's gonna be an A-H moment, and ah. Okay, so. I am going to specifically do Halloween timeline because we're getting the Hail to the King achievement, so I might as well wear the outfit associated with it, you know? It's not a requirement. We could do Timeline X for it to be more challenging, but we could also wear the funny outfit. Ohio. And I personally think that funny outfit wins. So, we just need to... And then I guess we could do the three dream enemies afterwards if we want to. Do I want to do Hunted? I think Hunted by the Cult's probably the better one to do. I don't really care particularly. We're not doing that misery worm again, I swear to god. We are not doing the misery worm. I actually might be willing to do Zectast, uh, interestingly enough. But, uh, maybe we should just try to make it easier on ourselves. Something that, uh, could help us out with Doom, maybe, or... Maybe speed up combat. You know what? Let's do a little Athuthu. Let's do a little Athuthu. A little, little marble statue in the museum. And we're gonna just, we're just gonna chill. So what we're gonna do here is quite simple. It really is quite so shrimple as that. Light source, knowledge, dexterity, second mystery, final boss, second enemy. So, what I really care about here specifically is the knowledge and the dexterity. I don't really care about anything else. I'll probably forget this, and I'll probably forget that. We should probably try to remember, though, because, you know, pretty important. But, uh, hopefully, hopefully, we'll be able to pull it off. So, let's just kind of, let's just kind of chill. I do want potentially extra stats. Keep the hardware store. Oh, no, this is so bad, actually. Hold on, hold on. So, we're gonna buy the flashlight from the dog. Oh, but you can't get the fuel. Okay, this is gonna be basically impossible. But we're gonna try it. We're at least gonna be able to get Hail to the King. We're at least gonna be able to get Hail to the King. With good RNG, we'll be able to win. Uh, but plus 10% Doom and no Monument is gonna hit like a truck. Now, if we could expel Evil here, that's pretty good too. Not gonna say no to that. No thank you. No thank you to saying no thanks to Ancestral Strength, because that's pretty cool. That's a pretty, pretty good one. So what we need is painting. We need a painting. We need a painting. That's a peculiar painting if I've ever seen one, chat. Uh, okay. Okay, this is not going to be free. This is definitely not going to be free. There, There's some difficulty in what we're going to do here, okay? Oh, I forgot the money. Does that matter? No, actually. Actually, yes, it does. Does it? No, because I'm going to get cursed twice anyways, and then we'll be left at one fund. Oh, we'll be left at one fund? That actually kind of sucks. <laughs> sure. Sure. Uh, now, we do need to go here. This is a mandatory... I don't care who you are. I'm taking you. 
Oh, that hurts so much. And it was Coco! Are you kidding me? Plus 15% doom for fun. Okay, we, we need to go to the Boreal Expanse ASAP. Oh, frick. Oh, no. I mean, it was knowledge and dexterity, right? So we'll just go ahead and get an injury there that we have to get cured. We can pretend we don't have it for now because we have plus two damage, but oh my god. Oh, no monument. No monument. No monument for homeboy. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. How do we get a light source before going into the flipping peculiar painting? Okay, no, 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 I can't do it. I can't. I, oh, no. 5% doom moment. Okay, jar of blood, jar of blood, jar of blood, jar of blood. Come on, jar of blood. Come on, jar of blood. Come on, jar of blood. No! Okay, it was incredibly unlikely. It was incredibly unlikely. Okay, 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 okay. We, we got this, though. We got this. We just take plus... Uh, 7% doom for fun. Just just plus 7% doom for fun. And then... Actually, no, because it's gonna be 3. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's gonna be 3. Oh, not if I... Please, can we sell this? No! No! Uh, can we sell the old shotgun? No, we cannot sell the old shotgun. We gotta reroll for a flashlight. Oh, no. Oh, no, just reroll the run. Just reroll the run. Oh my god. Okay, we could at least get a kill. We could at least get a kill with the with the with the chainsaw. I did I'm not even wearing the outfit. I'm not even wearing the outfit. Oh no. I didn't even use the police station either. Oh, we could have gotten the handcuffs and sold those. Okay, we can at least get a kill with the chainsaw, right? Right? We could at least get a kill with the chainsaw. Oh no. We really did have to get Kyoko. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, so what we can do here is pretty nice, actually. I'm not gonna complain about that. Now we go down to desperation range, apparently, which is pretty scary. And now I'm thinking, can we actually get a kill with the chainsaw? Are we gonna leave this mystery? And the answer to that is no, we're not gonna leave this mystery. We're gonna get minus two doom. And by minus two doom, I mean minus two reason. And then we're gonna get another minus two reason, and then we're gonna die. And then we're gonna re- Aw, oh, crap. I was gonna say we're gonna re-roll the run. But now we gotta- we gotta go, actually. 60% doom? Oh, no, 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 no. Well, win in Rome. Yeah, no, d never- never do what I did. Never take the- oh. If you want to easily get the higher two people and win the game achievement, just play Toshiaki. Don't try to double dip with this. Moriko doesn't have doom reduction. That's not built into her kit. We're fighting the boss. Screw you. I don't care. Get the hell out of here. You should stick together in this weird mansion. Nuh uh. Oh, I thought that that was the one. No, that's not the one where you trip on the branch. Okay, so, on one hand... We're gonna kill the boss with the chainsaw. It would be a ghost. It would be a ghost, you sick son of a gun. Oh, I love 5% doom. I love 5% doom. Oh, you scumbag. Alright, you. Oh no. I mean, we're gonna kill him. Okay, achievement unlocked in probably the weirdest way possible. Do we have to wear the, the outfit, actually? Am I dumb? I think you have to wear the outfit, don't you? You have to wear the Hail to the King outfit. That's probably correct, because I didn't see achievement go. So we should probably wear the Hail to the King outfit, huh? Yeah, okay. Yeah, we can we can probably do so yeah we can we can probably do something like that. Uh, no no we just need to survive. We just need to survive to the next combat. That's all we need to do. Just survive to the next combat. What do we got here? Oh hell yeah, abnormal arms. Easy mystery. Um. Okay, you're you're done. You're you're done. You're done. This the the tapeworm salary man is done and or dusted. Real, real. 
So what we can do is we can do that, which doesn't even matter. That doesn't even matter. Is there some other aspect to this achievement that I'm not getting? Hold on. We're gonna go to achievements. We're gonna go to achievements. I'm forgetting something, aren't I? I, I I'm definitely forgetting something. Where is Hail to the King? As Moriko, defeat an enemy with a working chainsaw. Chat, is this real? Am I crazy? Like, the first enemy that we killed... The first enemy that we encountered was Ishiro-san. Or, sorry, no, it was the ghost, but we ran away from the ghost. And so the first enemy that we killed was Ishiro-san. And then we just killed Tapeworm Salaryman. Oh, as Moriko, defeat an enemy with a work. Me when I defeat an enemy with a work. Sorry guys, I don't I don't have a work. I don't, I don't have I don't have a work. I don't know what that is. I don't I don't have a work. I don't know what that is. I can't tell you what a work is. Honestly, I'm sorry. I don't I don't know what a work is. I I've never um I've never seen with a work in the game before. Now, two allies in one playthrough, huh? That's pretty cool. I wonder what that means. Um, okay, so we're gonna die. I, I was gonna say that after we die here, what we can do is we can run it back as Toshiaki and do Dream and hire two allies, because that doesn't matter. Like, Toshiaki's just busted, you know? Uh, we throw it up to chance. Yeah, okay. Now, game, game goes on, game goes on. And, uh, you know, the chain, the, the Cyclops neighbor is weak to the chainsaw, you know? So, uh... I think that's a I think that's working as like intended you know did that work oh we got one new achievement how the did, did running away from the ghost count hold on did running away from the ghost count I'm so confused anyways sure we're, we're just gonna 100% complete the game right now um sure why not very confused incredibly confused but that's okay you Moshi Moshi, indeed. So here's what we're gonna do. We need to three dream enemies and hire two allies and win the game. So you know what we're gonna do. You know what this means. You know what this entails. It's Toshiaki gaming. This will be incredibly easy. Now we do need to make sure that we have that one mystery. Oh, we got the Herald. Oh, let's go. We, we gotta run it back with the Herald just for old times sake. Okay, so seconds, dexterity, charisma, strength. Okay, every stat check known to man, your seconds. I actually do need to remember this as a treat. Okay, so seaside, hardware shop, be gone, illegal den, hello. Just in case it all goes horribly wrong. And then, yeah, I think you just run it like that. I think that's pretty fine. Don't forget the money this time. And uh, let's just get a nice suit. Toshiaki deserves the nice things in life. He deserves the drip. So what we can do pretty easily is we need to re-roll for coma because that's the only way we can see the... Wait, what, what we're looking for here is ideally, if we want to do it without forcing it, we need to get lots of forest mysteries and a hospital mist and, and coma specifically. Not a hospital mystery, just coma specifically because what happens is the two dream enemies the dream eater and the dream salesman are in the forest and then the dream devourer is the final boss of coma so we just need to reroll until we see it which we did not get it here and we would ideally like forest mysteries alongside of it so freaky feature botany that sort of thing I almost want to re-roll it until we get, like, a forest mystery alongside Coma. Yeah, sure. Cool. Uh, we Because I, I want to minimize the amount of times we actually have to go to the forest, just, like, as a treat, you know? So, we didn't get library notes as our, as our bonus item. Very sad. But what we can do is uh, just win the game easily, because we're playing Toshiaki, and it's... Yeah. 
Now, ideally, we get a nice little book. Look at that. I, I would like another book. If that, that Maybe that's being a little bit greedy, but I would like another book. Sheep Surge is also really good. I'll go up to like eh, 15, then we'll see how long it takes me to get my weapon. Okay, yeah, well, we'll come back. We'll come back for it later. We'll come back for it later. Now, what weapons can you buy at the dog store? Just a steak knife? I mean, good enough. I hope. Oh my god, is this- hold on. Hold on, no. Is this- is it time for the illegal den? I think it is. Now, I also need to go back here and get an ally, if you, if you don't mind. Thank you so much. So, you know, I want another book. But other than that, I think this is pretty great. We're at minus 20% doom right now, effectively. And so, well, not effectively, because, like, we can't spend it all. And then we, we can't spend 70% doom and then be like, oh, we got minus 20. It's like, no, it's not, you know. We're not going to spend that much doom in a single mystery anyway. So it's like, potato, potato, tomato, tomato. It's fine. Um, I mean, it's not really like we have any good stats, so we might as well. The seaside is doom? You scumbag? Me and apartment stalker Rutsu. Okay, so, I mean, you're just kind of a dick. You know, it's a little mean. Ow. Can we do... Ah, the folly of not having another book. Now, hold on. Can we do prep attack? Prep attack. No, we cannot. I mean, that's an 80% chance, though. So that'll do 12, so we throw the empty bottle. Oh, well, yo! Empty bottle pog popping off? Let's go. Is the baseball bat faster? N no, god no. Wait, the baseball bat is... Wait, did the baseball bat get nerfed? I thought the baseball bat was actually, like, usable. I've said in the past the baseball bat is usable. Am I, am I just blind? 95? Does Kiwi know about this? <laughs> Weapon chart? No! Oh my god. No, like, oh my god, like, seriously, that's, like, 95 speed? Really? Like, you, you wouldn't do that to, you, you wouldn't do that to the poor baseball bat. It was already bad. Well, okay, no, the, did the baseball bat get nerfed? Am I going crazy? Yeah, we'll just take peace of mind, that's fine, I don't really care. Um, like, oh my god. Like, I'm trying to think here, like, what on earth? Like, Jesus. Because I, I thought the baseball bat was like 80. Or like 85. Did it actually get... There's no way it got nerfed, right? There's no There's no way it got nerfed. That's crazy. Because the, the problem with the baseball bat was always just that you had to kill Apartment Stalker to get it. And he's one of the harder enemies to get in the game. Like, he's one of the harder enemies and... Just, like, pretty rare, because they're only in one location, you know? So it's like, I don't know, that's wild. That That is actually pretty nuts. Like, I, I don't know, I don't know what to say. I, I don't know what to say at all. The box cutter does, like, one damage when thrown. But this is a really good weapon, though, I'm not gonna lie. So if we need to fight a boss, we could absolutely go Kaneta cut a boss with the box cutter. Maybe we should save the box cutter for the for coma? That sounds like a good idea, actually. Medusa, scissors, botany. I mean botany is the way to go. Real and true. So we'll put the box cutter away. We have a we have a specific use case for it. Can I like get a book? Like, I don't mean to be rude, but like, do you, do you mind giving me like a book? Like just a little one? Oh yo! I'll take a tome too! Uh, well, I will not say no to a tome. Thank you so much. This is a pretty easy double investigate for 15 EXP. 
we get a little minus two doom by rolling a one as a treat, you know? Just as like a little treat. But uh, what was I gonna say? We have to see the dream enemies. We have to see the dream enemies. So this run theoretically, like, I mean, we have to decide what we want to prioritize. And I think the priority is going to be if we encounter a dream enemy, then we're going to go for the second one. And then we'll just like kill the dream devourer with the with the thingy that we just got from Young Witch. You know, you don't really want to get hit here. Go ahead and throw the baseball bat. And then what you want to do, very simply, is that, and then that. And then the game's bugged, and you just win. It's that easy. It's just as simple as that. You you do 206 time units instead of 200, and you just win the game. It really is quite so shrimple. Oh, oh the forest is doomed, huh? Probably should have seen that one coming. But that's okay. So yeah, if we see at least one dream enemy here, I think we just keep spamming the forest until the end of time. We want to see both. Like, seeing both in this mystery is legitimately, like, one of the... Like, seeing both in this mystery is, like, it's meant to be, the green light has happened, the best RNG of all time, etc, etc, etc. We'll take plus one strength just in case we get otherworlded. I don't really want strength. I mean, I guess we do have every stat check known to man. So the next point would be getting, uh, whatchamacallit, Charisma done. She's doing one to all. I mean, you just kind of repeat what we've been doing this whole run, I guess. And by that, I mean we're dodging. For fun. You know, it's, not, it's a 50% chance. I mean, that works. Now, ideally, when you're playing Toshiaki, you do want to replace your early game items with books as much as possible. Because it's like, that's just good cycling. Like, you're using the item, you're getting value from the item, and then you're getting a book, which is just like a permanent buff for the rest of your run. Now, the army knife, how do I talk about the army knife? 85 speed is, like, pretty bad. But, like, this stat spread's, like, kind of busted. Like, 70%, 70 chance to hit, 70 accuracy, 70% chance to hit, 5 damage, 85 speed. I think it's actually, like, pretty good. I think the army knife did get buffed. Now, would I recommend taking the illegal den? Uh, not really, it's pretty bad, but the army knife is at least usable now. And if you want to play a perception build, it's probably the way to go because you can't guarantee, uh, whatchamacallit, a chainsaw. Because chainsaw is the, you know, only other good perception weapon that's not Moriko's old shotgun. Real. And, uh, there's not really... I I'm trying to think of perception weapons. I guess box cutter is really good. Box cutter is a direct upgrade. It's faster, and it does more damage, but Box Cutter can break. Army Knife can't. You know, rules, regulations, that sort of thing. So we haven't seen any Dream Enemies, just so you know. So that sucks. So I guess we just keep going on. I guess we go to School Scissors, mainly because, like, I'm pretty sure there's an event that gets you a book at some point. What do we got here? Oh. Alright, we're fighting a boss. I don't care then. Give me the ammunition to throw. I'm pretty sure there's like an event here that can get you a book. So that's literally just why I went here. Third, there's not really any... Like, we're strong enough to fight bosses, so... I don't really, you know, care about any mystery that we do. I do want to save the other dream, the Dream Devourer for last. Mainly because of just how it works. Yeah, sure, screw it. What's the worst that could happen? We get uh, our face cut by scissors? Yeah, that'd be pretty bad. I'm pretty sure it was that one. I don't really care. It could be either boss. We could get the cursed scissors. We could not get the cursed scissors. I don't really mind either way. We're not on Knight Errant, so it's not something that I have to really care about. Um, 
Do you want to just, like... Can we do both an attack? No, no, that would be broken. That, that would actually be, like, disgustingly broken. We're gonna take one stamina damage. It's a calculated one stamina damage. And then we're just gonna move on with our lives. Because I could have thrown the wooden bat, but I'd rather throw the wooden bat at the boss. Because we are gonna, like, not be able to kill the boss in, like, one turn, so... Because, mainly just because of Blood Moon. Like, Blood Moon, just coming in, enemies get plus 20 power. That's pretty bad. Blood Moon is horrible. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, we can just Brace, take one to all. That's a pretty average event, honestly. Events usually do more damage. So, like, you just take one to all and you kill the boss. That's, that's pretty fun. Now, the Thoth Flash is absolutely fantastic. You love to see it. And then I guess we just take a point of charisma so that we can hopefully get Sheb Surge and not die to the lighthouse. Sounds pretty good. But after this, I think we just put every point into perception that we can. Like, just perception max as much as possible. Catch me perceiving, catch me noticing. Yeah, I just think we do coma last. So, we're coming down to the realization that we have not seen any dream enemies. And we now have to decide if we are going to throw the run to see the dream enemies. And then we either have to do the illegal den run again, which is incredibly easy on Toshiaki. Or we have to kill the dream enemies, which is not exclusively something you can do on Toshiaki. A lot of characters can kill all the dream enemies pretty easily. But... I was hoping we could get a two-for-one, so that I could do everything in this video. I just buy them around, you know? Like, uh, that's fine. Can I get a book, you mind? Thank you so much. And because we didn't take anything else from the... that That's why, typically, you only want to take, like... Unless you get library notes, you only want to take... Whatchamacallits from the History Club books. If you get library notes, you take two books from the History Club. If you don't get library notes, you take three books from the History Club. And then your run is just, like, settled for until the end of time, really. I mean, it's basically always worth it to do this. Now, Forest Investigation, you know what that means. It means nothing, unfortunately. And I'm thinking, like, we have the... We have the police station on the forest. Do we go for it? And I think the answer... Oh, that's beautiful. I think the answer is yes, just because, like, we have to fish for it anyways, so it's like... Let, let's... I, I don't want to get to the end of this mystery, because the final investigation is seaside. But we can get, like, as close as possible, I suppose. And just send it. You can miss one. And we missed two. That's fine. Give him a chance. I mean, he's tied to a chair, right? Like, how, how often he's gonna... Okay, we got 51% Doom. We're getting minus 20. I mean... Yeah, yeah, I, I think we just go for it. Like, the, the problem is, is that I'm trying to greed two achievements. Alright, this is one of them. This, this is one of them. This is confirmed one plush toy. Just do it big, just do it big, just do it big. Oh, baby. Uh, so that's one of them. Now, will we be able to get all of them? I don't know. What's my cutoff point? Like 70, 80? I think 70 or 80% Doom is probably the cutoff point. Maybe I should do this in the last. Like, even though it means we got to... Um, even if it means we have to put the police station back, I think it's still probably better to get to the end of whatchamacallit first. Because we basically are throwing the run on this. Like, we, we literally are just throwing the run on this right now. So, even though we're going to have to move the police station back, which is plus 1% doom, I think we get to the end of, uh, we get to the end of Coma with the sparkly dust, of course. Which actually, that does mean, by the way, that we will not be able to have four books when we fight this thing. Oh man, that's great. That's great. I mean, you just got to do this at this point. Like, you're just getting so many attacks off. Can we make all of them 70? Oh my god. Now, you can still miss all of your attacks. Like, that's, uh... 
that's still allowed to happen. And so we should probably, like, you know, shape up some, uh, some guaranteed outcomes for fun there. Just to help with the consistency. Contaminated water, fetid fumes. Okay, okay. Keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. The village is dangerous. Do we just want to go to two dangerous locations? We have the cure, so it's not like... It's not like it's the end of the world, but let's let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. We'll see what we got. Technically speaking, we could use Hermit if we wanted to. And if we used Hermit, then we would have to go back to the illegal den to get a new person. Uh, 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 eto, uh, eto. That's what we're actually going to do. That is actually unironically what we're going to do. Uh, goodbye, Hermit. We go back to the illegal den. We get this guy. And then... I mean, you know, we're not really happy with what just happened there, but... That's okay. <laughs> is, th is this a buy a backpack moment so you can have all your books? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. We're actually just gonna use the occult diary, I think. And I'm okay with that. We get the dust, we use the Occult Diary, we have a better, faster weapon anyways, so it's like, yeah, I think that's okay. Although, of course, we have to keep looking for the stupid enemy, so I don't really know what to say, actually. We, have to, we haven't seen Dream Salesman yet, or at least I'm pretty sure we haven't. It would be very funny. It, it would be very funny, actually. Uh, all right, we got 79% doom. We can do a few investigations for fun. And then at some point, we just got to break it off and just get the other achievement, you know? Uh, yeah, sure. Get a grip. That's fine. Get a grip gel. Very useful crafting component. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we're dead. No, it's fine. If we have to cast cure, then I think it's like just jover you know like you just leave immediately we do have the monument that's true so it's like not horrible cut artery uh yeah sure we'll go one more time yeah now that's too risky okay so first of all here's what we're gonna do we are going to and, uh, okay, we, we're just gonna take what we've got, and we're just gonna be happy with what we have, okay? So, I mean, yeah, that's it. We're, we're just gonna be, we, are we gonna have to cast the cure again? We are, but we have two occult diaries, so it's fine. Okay, you are terrifying. But, we can do this, and it would be really funny. It would be really funny. Do I throw the game on this? Oh god, do I throw the game on this? I, I really want to. I really want to throw the game on this. It would be really funny. It would be really funny to throw the game on this. I'm gonna throw the funny mask, and we're going. Baby, that's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. All right, Sheep Surge. Cool, cool, cool. And, uh, I don't know. We'll take... I mean, we're gonna have to cast it five times anyways, right? So, I think actually what we want to do is maybe level up Perception again, baby. I don't really care because I just kind of wanted one thing and one thing only, which I didn't get. I was kind of hard stuck on that, which we did not get that. So, uh, we do not have the final boss, so just use these. I don't care. Honestly? Here's what we're going to do instead of using Sheep Surge. Although, I guess we could just use Sheep Surge right now, if I wanted to. Because what is this going to be? 
Does it still display it incorrectly, or does it actually do it properly now? Did Sheep Surge get get buffed, or... Does this display properly? I'm gonna check. No, it doesn't. Cool. Very fun. Very cool. Now, we could, like, technically still lose, I, I guess... Just for fun, but, you know, I don't really... It is what it... Oh, we have Innsmouth look? Oh my god, Innsmouth look could kill us. In Innsmouth look could kill us. Okay, hold on. Drink the bottle of wine, and then cast that again. Sorry, 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 sorry. I, I could... How, how could I be so foolish? We have Innsmouth look in the lighthouse. We have two Innsmouth looks in the lighthouse. Oh, okay. We we can lose. It's possible to lose. Uh, the second mystery we did was botany. All right. We should no longer be able to lose. But oh my god, that's so funny. I was thinking like, oh my god, we have Innsmouth look. Innsmouth look could kill us in the lighthouse. Now it hasn't procked yet, admittedly. Um, who was our second enemy? You. I just guessed. I just guessed. It didn't matter. I just guessed. Because you want to know why it didn't matter? Hmm. Toshiaki moment. Maybe we could have used Fathoth Flash to farm something out. But we'll, we'll just kill the dream enemies on the next episode. That's fine. I'm okay with that. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Webweaver. I'll see you on the next episode of World of Horror. Uh, so that means two episodes from now... That will be the 100% uh, completion reward. I know what it is because I got spoiled, but if you do not know what it is, I will not spoil you. It won't be the, it won't be the title, it won't be the thumbnail. Well, the title will be like the 100% completion reward or something like that. Um, just so that I can, I, I can actually show it and talk about it in a spoiler-free manner. So it's like, if you click on the video, it's like, yeah, you, you, you know. You know me when I know. Real. True. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Have a good one. I'll see you on the next episode of World of Horror. Bye.